Glory be to God. Can we rise up and just wave? It's a form of worship. Come what may, Jesus must reign. Come what may, Jesus must reign. Come what may. Come, Come what may. may. Jesus must reign. Jesus, Jesus must reign. Come what may. Come what may. Jesus must reign. Jesus must reign over the land. Jesus must reign over Nigeria. Come what may. Jesus must reign. Come, come what may, day. Jesus must reign. Come, come, come what may, Jesus must reign. Come what may, Jesus must reign. Come what may, come what may, Jesus must reign. Come what may, come what may, Jesus must reign. Jesus must reign over this land. Jesus must reign. Over Nigeria, come what may, Jesus must reign. Come what may, Jesus must reign. In Jesus' name. Amen. We are going to remain standing because we are going into a prophetic hour. I want to celebrate Mama. Thank you so much, Ma. You were with us at TBS two years ago. You stayed throughout. We appreciate you, ma. And the team that came with her, thank you so much. I want to thank Pastor Bidemi, Mike Modi too. She was with us. Pastor Lami De Adeleye, thank you so much. All the women of God, Pastor IB, I celebrate you, Evangelist Christy, and our own dear Reverend. She did the opening prayer. That was two years ago. Last year, the Lord said, don't organize any prayer for Nigeria. People are pained. Are you with me? If you see the um, pamphlet, the Lord said, don't, or, you can't just say hey, every year like anniversary. He said, no, this, this is not a program like Sarah Sarah is our anniversary. He said, no, the people are pained. Somebody will come to pray. Yeah, were people not pained? But you see, before the elections, people were afraid. We all gathered because of fear. If you look at that pamphlet, please give some of the people here. All over, and the Nehemiahs rose up. Women were praying in Belarus, Malaysia. Even now, people in America are praying. They are sending their videos. They are keeping a vigil. You know why? No matter where they are, this is still their land. So we are going into this hour, and this 12 o'clock, all of us, all over Nigeria, this is the instruction, two minutes more. I want you, please, everybody, you are going to pray like never before. I want you to imagine that person, that youth copper, that you spent money on, going to the place of assignment by Owo, and they killed them. Ah! It's too much. I want you to imagine the person that entered the bus right here, on Lake Ekwe and ended up in Libya. Her mother sent her to go and buy something. Right here, she ended up in Libya. It's our watch. Tell your neighbor it's our watch. Eh, it's our watch. If you don't know, you say, is it only prayer that will say right? Whatever you want to do, do. If you want to write, write. If you want to cry, cry. If you want to protest, protest. But we will pray. It's not by power. It's not by might. Have you not even seen leaders who, when they are even there, the forces around them, it's too much. Are you ready to cry? I want you to imagine the man who was in his house and kidnappers came and killed. People, they are killing people like water. As I blow the shofar, 12 noon, check your time. As I'm blowing the shofar here, they are blowing it in Abuja. They are blowing it in Lilorim. You are going to cry. Begin to say divine intervention. Lift up your voice. Intercessors, take the microphone. Begin to declare divine intervention. Wrap up for you. Let the angels of God begin to arise. How can it be 
release this prophetic word I need your thunderous Lord arise and judge the matter what did I say the matter Lord arise and judge the matter God arise and judge can we say it God God arise and judge and judge the matter. Matter. over every wickedness in this nation Lord arise and judge the matter he's the most high God they say any matter that is beyond you who do you take it to God must arise over every wickedness in this nation. Lord, Lord arise and judge the matter. Over killing of innocent people in this nation. Lord, Lord arise and judge the matter. Over shedding of innocent blood. Lord, Lord arise and judge the matter. Over political sabotage in this Lord. nation. Lord, Lord arise and judge the matter. Over economic problems in Nigeria. Lord, Lord arise. Over manipulation and wickedness in Nigeria. Lord, arise and judge the matter. Over kidnapping and rituals in Nigeria. Lord, arise and judge the matter. Over every form of mismanagement in Nigeria. Lord, arise and judge the matter. Over embezzlement and looting of treasuries. Lord, arise and judge the matter. Over every form of Infrastructural decay. Lord, arise and judge the matter. Over every form of deception. Lord, arise and judge the matter. Father, Lord, we lift up Nigeria to you. Enough. Enough. Is enough. Children sent to school are being killed. Were we not here? When they abducted Chibo girls, how many more girls have they wasted their destiny? A girl sent to school, being slept with by, by useless. Oh my God, it's painful. I saw, I saw the picture of a boy in Surulere. I don't know whether they kidnapped him. Or, I felt it from here. We began to pray. Thank God they found him. Hallelujah. Do you know how many people are paying quiet ransom? They are paying what? Quiet ransom. Ah, no. No. We reject it. Amen. Yes, we reject it. We reject it in the name of Jesus. Yes. Amen. Kidnapper, open TikTok. Hey. What has happened to us? Kidnapper. My village, Ifo Ondo State, our king was killed. He went for a meeting in Akure, was going back like two years ago. Monarchs are being slaughtered. People cannot go back to their village. And we are, we are watching. We didn't hear it before. It's creeping. It's creeping. Our youths. They, now, I'm afraid of anybody below 40. If they take Colorado, they can kill anybody because of 100,000. I tell you, we're in a dangerous world. Ajumogobia's daughter inside the, the Pushes, Pushes estate was killed. Her body thrown by the gate. Oh my God. Ah, Kiloshi, what has happened to this country? You are going to lift up. Join your hand. One of us shall put a thousand to fly. Two of us will chase 10,000. Whatever God has to do, He has to do. Wickedness must stop in this nation. Amen. Systemic decay. Systemic decay. <laughs> Administrative, whatever it is that, is that has turned people. Today, we're going to lift up our voice. Oh, lift up your voice. Sing the name of Jesus. In the name, name of Jesus. Jesus. Let there be a divine turn around. Let, Let there be a divine, divine turn around. In this nation. In this nation. In the name of Jesus. Name divine turn around. Lift up your voice. He carabo. Righteous. 
of indignation. Arise! In the name of Jesus, righteous indignation. Righteous indignation. Makuna Koyana. Ikalebo Yadana. Zata. Zata. Rekoko Yadana. Borders, but thou shalt call thy wall salvation, thy gates praise. Violence will no more be heard. Amen. We are going to release the fear of God into the forest. People of God, I've seen the fear of God at work. Some things you can't share. Some people determine to do evil, but when the fear of God enters them, is it not in the Bible that they heard a sound and they began to run? Yes, ma'am. How can there be strongholds? Why is food expensive? It is because some people have chased away some people from their farmlands. Food is not expensive in Ghana. Even in Benin Republic. When they chase them away from the farmland, then you and I will be paying so much for food. How do we stop it? <laughs> Even the police, they are having police to escort them. Are you with me? But we will send the army of the Lord. The fishermen, the fishers, we are releasing hey, hey, the arsenal of God Amen. to begin to visit those places Amen. where authorities are afraid to go to. Divine fishermen Amen. to begin to fish them out. Amen. Let the fear of God begin to consume them. Amen. Lift up your voice. Amen. Every location Amen. in Nigeria, Nigeria. where they are passing where they are causing violence that is making us to suffer oh in the name of Jesus oh scatter them scatter them scatter them in the name of Jesus lift up your voice oh God your car in those years there is no December that there will be no bomb blast you remember in Abuja I people remember it was the season of bomb blast there is no holiday that there will be no bomb blast what has happened now it has not fully finished but it was tackled in the spirit what we are doing here you will get the testimony in Jesus name. Amen. We will enjoy the testimony in Jesus name. Amen. This will cause leaders to be able to do right. 
because there's something called the spirit of politics it is not just ordinary politics there is a spirit behind it that possesses men and they become greedy and they, they do not even think of the people we're going to lift up our voices again and we're going to begin to judge the spirit of greed people are dying in the hospitals hospitals that are supposed to work things that are not supposed to kill people is killing people in Nigeria roads have been on paper tarred yet somebody has collected the money ah God must judge them ah God must they must see the fear of God lift up your voice say in the name of Jesus we judge every form of embezzlement leading to failure leading to death leading to destruction lift up your voice the name of Jesus Nigerians are brilliant enough. We've got the resources. But evil strong men, they will sit on the system. Let me tell you, it's not only the leaders, though. This prayer will hit some people. I'm telling you. Everybody will be talking about the leader, the leader, the leader. And I was sharing the story I saw online. A principal said, photographer, take 500 students in my school. Passport photograph for 400 naira oh he, he beat it down to 200 he called the teacher tell the students they will take passports it is 300 principal put 100 the teacher went to the students and said tell your parents passport is 500 the student got to the mommy and said mommy they said we should do we should uh, take passport in school is 700 the woman waited for her husband to come. When the husband came, he said, Honey, Junior has to take passport. It's 2,000. Then the father said, Tinubu. Are you with me? Is that the president? Oh. Eh, from all of us, wickedness must leave us. Yeah. Yeah. I said, the Wickedness must, even in the church. Set up a committee to go and buy generator, they will load it. Big denominations, scandals, scandals. The spirit of righteousness must enter all of us. Amen. Uh, yes, when the spirit of righteousness enters all of us, that thing will not be enticing to us. Yes. But we want to see the good of all. Say spirit of righteousness. Spirit of righteousness. Enter everybody. In the name of Jesus, lift up your voice. We judge every spirit of grief. Every spirit of wickedness in our lives, in the lives of our children, in the lives of our husband. Father Lord, we take it away in the name of Jesus. We repent of every greed that has led us so far. Oh God, we ask for your mercy. Thank you, Jesus. We bless your name. Thank you, God. And we begin to decree and declare over Nigeria. We call forth a new spirit. Amen. It says, and I will give them a new spirit. Amen. Let the Lord give every Nigerian a new spirit. Amen. It can happen. Yeah. I tell you, it's by the Holy Ghost. When God gives all of us a new spirit, we just refuse it. 
People just say, no, 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 no. Things have to work. Enough is enough. When, where is it going to stop? When is it going to stop? It keeps coming round and round and it keeps hitting any of us. I tell some people, you think you are rich. You are not rich enough until you have enough to take care of your medical challenges. What did I say? You have enough. I don't judge your riches by your car. That's why you see celebrities. When they become sick, they are fame. It goes. They begin to beg for money. You are not rich enough until you can take care of your health. Because that's the one. May we not have health challenges that will turn us to poppers. Amen. May we not have health challenges that will make us to become to begin to beg. Amen. Yeah. And that is why the system must work. The system must work. In South Africa, even the poorest people, if you need, they have insurance for everybody. If you want to do surgery, only you need to pay 50 rand. The system takes care of it. That's why the system must take care of many things because not everybody can take care of it. Say the system of Nigeria must work. The system of Nigeria must work. Every, every blockage, every, every strong man against the system of Nigeria. We all sit you by fire. Lift up your voice. Lift up your voice. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, yes, yes. In the name of Jesus. Educational system. from Cameroon in my class. Yeah. They used to come from African countries. In University of Ifeth, we had a lot of them. They would come. Now we are the ones going. Even our graduates, half-baked, you want to employ them, they cannot write well, they cannot speak well. If you don't have money, I didn't go to a private school. I went to a public school. Anglican Girls Primary School. Public schools were good. Yeah. Public schools owned by the Anglican Church. You will come out, you'll be speaking excellently. But now, if you cannot pay millions for your children, only God knows what the child will turn out to be. What has happened? We are going to decree the educational system of Nigeria must receive deliverance. Uh, when the system works, every spiritual say every spiritual stronghold, every spiritual stronghold. on our educational system, our educational we command system. you to break. Lift up your voice in the name of Jesus. Rapoko Yata. Jesus. Mighty name we pray. Amen. Oh Lord, deliver Nigeria. Oh Lord, deliver Nigeria. From greed. From greed. An ostentatious living. An ostentatious living. Ma, I don't understand. The harder we are complaining that we don't have money, the more you see people spraying money at parties. They don't, I don't know. Are you, don't you see? The more you see ostentatious living, while some are in abject poverty, some go into all sorts of things. 14 year old doing yawi yawi. It's a terrible thing. 
Say, oh Lord, deliver Nigeria from greed. Oh Lord, deliver Nigeria from greed. Deliver Nigerians from greed. Deliver Nigerians from greed. And ostentatious living. And ostentatious living. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Oh Lord, deliver Nigeria. From wastage of resources. From wastage of resources. In the name of Jesus. Deliver Nigeria. From national manipulation. There used to be a company, a tire company. Now they are gone. You and I will go and buy Tokumbo tire. God forbid. This is how people die in accidents. Because the industries have collapsed. Smith Climb Beacham, they've left. People that have asthma, there is something they used to take. <laughs> people don't know the extent of the decadence that has happened. If anybody has asthma now, that thing used to be 1,400. They call it Ventolin. How much is it now? 35,000. Can you see? God forbid somebody has a child who has asthma and is a cleaner earning 25,000. What has happened? Can you see? Where? Oh, go, oh, go! But we have lost many things. Father, restore. Father, restore our economy. Father, restore us in Nigeria in the name of Jesus. Lift up your voice. mighty name. Amen. I raise this altar. Standing on the altar on the 13th of August with mama and about 20 women of God at TBS where we got our independence. The Lord said we should locate the exact spot. And we located that exact spot. Some of you were there with 20 women of God. We joined our our hands together and we raised a new altar. I'm standing on that new altar. We rekindle that altar. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. And we raise this altar again. Amen. In the name of the Father. Amen. Altar of righteousness. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. We don't know how God will do it, but we know He can do it. Amen. And we raise this altar that in this nation, ah. Times of refreshing will come again. Amen. I went to, I went to, what they call that place in Lagos Island. That place, CMS. And I saw the train. It's very short to Orile, but it is the beginning. Are you with me? Yes, ma'am. It is the beginning. No matter how, God can use a Cyrus. Are you with me? Yes, ma. God can use who? Cyrus. Cyrus. We raise altar that every good thing that God has started in this nation, let it continue in the name of Jesus. Amen. We raise the altar that our educational system, our healthcare system, every system, political system, Father Lord, revive for the better in the name Amen. of Jesus. Amen. We decree and declare. We 
wickedness be judged in this land. We soak every Nigerian in the blood of Jesus. Jesus. And we decree no more wastage of life. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Give Him praise in the house.